Hey everybody, it's your girl Nikki Proverbs 31 and I want to come on real quick and give you an update. Um, wow, what's going on with me? <laughs> right now I'm just laying down. I'm extremely uncomfortable. Those who have went through the IVF journey before, you know my pain. And for those who don't and who are about to embark on this journey, um, you know, the stimming process makes you feel extremely uncomfortable. Um, it's really hard for me to get comfortable in the bed. I toss and turn all last night. So you're uncomfortable walking, sitting, laying down. But according to my um, doctor's appointment today, they're saying that I, um, they only could see like six mature or uh, measurable follicles. Something that that does not compute because I feel like I'm about to burst open. But anywho, um, so for my doctor's appointment today, my leading follicle is at 16. Um, it's definitely different from last year, and I did talk to my RE nurse um, about that and asked her what could be the reason why I'm not responding as well as I did last year. And she said, you know what, honestly, I don't know. So, it's just amazing how different this cycle is from last year's cycle. Um, this time last year I had about maybe 15 follicles, but I only had five mature eggs. Um, they, they did retrieve seven eggs and five of them were mature. And um, so I don't know how that came up how that was the case when I had so many follicles but I didn't have a lot of eggs and this time around I'm praying that we'll get you know enough eggs to uh, do what we need to do my nurse today said that she doesn't think that we'll have enough to freeze but again this is all in God's hands I'm not gonna let nobody speak any to anything into my life I'm watching even what I say the words that I speak um, but you know today I was kind of you know feeling low was get, that funk was trying to come back on me and so I just turned on my praise and worship music and I just started just you know I can't really dance right now but I did one of them grandma dances <laughs> like you see grandmas be dancing shouting at church now I feel them but um so I'm just scooting around just saying you know Lord, you are good, you know, and so I'm not going to let anybody um, steal my joy, not even myself. So, um, I'm drinking my Gatorade and have, I got some Kellogg protein drinks by Kellogg, y'all, by Kellogg, hint, hint. Um, so, what else is going on with me? Oh, so she told me that I would get a call from my RE up door. Y'all forgive me. I'm sorry. I've been sleeping a lot too. Um, so I got a call from them and they were like, your plan is to do your 375 units of Gano F plus your five units of uh, Lupron and we want to see you tomorrow morning. I'm like, tomorrow morning? Why? And my husband was not happy with that. But I was so, but I did find out my E2 levels is um, 1750. And my uterine lining was 12 and a half. And um, she was saying that because they don't know if I'm going to do the whole weekend, stem the whole weekend. So that she just wanted to, they want to just take a look at me and then determine if more than likely I'll either be stemming on Sunday. Well, maybe, wait a minute. I'll, I'm, I will probably be stemming one or the two days or three days saturday sunday or monday or maybe tuesday i don't know your guess is good as mine Ooh, let's play the game when will nikki stem whenever i don't care i just want this to be done right so anywho um so yeah we have to get up and we have to be there at 9 45 in the morning fun 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 for us and um what else something else i was going to tell you guys thank you for all the comments and even the messages i have tons of them and i will respond i just been really like 
I, I, I slept a lot today and again because I'm just uncomfortable I'm kind of crabby I don't know you guys will know if you haven't if you don't know already you will know so to all my psycho buddies I'm praying for you all Lady Mosley I'm praying for you and those babies and uh, don't be scaring me like that girl um, and uh, hopeful I'm so excited to, to hear your news about your big fat positive and there's a host of you guys and I'm sorry I'm just I'm tired as you all can probably can see so I'm gonna get off and I um, pray peace and blessings to you all smooches <laughs>